to swap me that I, I wanted to use a different canvas or use a three-dimensional canvas. I said, I'm going to get a mannequin. I'm going to see what I can do with it. And then, uh, you know, it evolved and I uh, composed pieces and I, uh, and I add paint to it. And it's, uh, you know, aesthetically pleasing from a three-dimensional uh, view. And they all have names and code names and meanings behind them. And I've created this whole army. In my studio, I have 25 of them. And and they are here to save the souls of man. They fight for the common man, right? We're always left behind. We're always, uh, we're always paying too many taxes, and we're always taking parking tickets. It's really it starts to bother me. So, um, anyway, that the, the first one there, which is all graffiti, um, that is called the Informer, and she represents the streets, right? She gets the intel from the streets. What's happening? You know who's who's doing the uh, dubious things, and then she reports back to home base to the warriors, and then we decide, as uh, you know, as humanity, what we can do to solve the problems of the world. You know, so um, she is the informer. It's all found object assemblage, and um, she's all tagged up because the streets are all graffitied up, and uh, I really enjoy that. And um, the next one is called, what is it called again now? The Proclaimer. The Proclaimer. It had a different name, but we changed it today. Uh, she is the Proclaimer. She, pro she proclaims truth, and she gives a voice to the voiceless, and she cuts through all of the, uh, the red tape of the, the bureaucratic system that enslaves our soul. But she's also very light and very, uh, very 60s. I try to make each one different and unique. And they all, they are all, even though they, uh, they are very political, they should be beautiful, and they also uh, are fun to look at. So um, there you go. Thank you very much.